Welcome to our channel True Radiations. If you want to know about the top autonomous colleges in Telangana for the year 2021, then this is the video for you. As many of our subscribers were asking for this video, so here it is. Autonomous colleges are always better than non-autonomous colleges. The list of the colleges in our video is purely based on NIR ranking 2021 and also with the NAC accreditations, NB accreditations and also with the placements. So you can blindly believe our ratings for the counseling. At number 10, we have BV Raju Institute of Technology, which is often termed as BVRIT. Now, here many of the students get confused when choosing a BVRIT college because it has another campus with the same name. So here we can provide you with the MSET code, which is useful when opting for web options. It is accredited with NAC and A with A grade, and also it is got accredited with NBA. The college fee is around one lakh twenty thousand per annum, and it is affiliated with JNTUH. Then comes Mahatma Gandhi Institute of Technology at number nine, and here are its basic details. We are giving it three stars out of five stars. At number eight, we have Srinidhi Institute of Science and Technology. Here are its important details, and also it got NAC A plus accreditation, which means it comes in tier one colleges of Telangana. Then comes Kakatiya Institute of Technical Science Varangal at number seven. It is the only college that is on this list from Kakatiya University, which is in Varangal. Choose the MSET codes properly before opting for web options. Then comes Sivya College of Engineering at number six, which came into boom recently. It was below top ten colleges, but recently it got secured good NIR ranking, but still it has NAC A grade. I won't recommend this college as it is highly unstable when comes to ranking. Then comes Vasavi College of Engineering. It is staying consistently in the top five colleges from the past five years. It also has NAC A plus plus accreditation, which is really an amazing grade from NAC. I would highly recommend this college for CSC, IT, and ECE branches. At number four, we have Vardhaman College of Engineering, which is in Shamshabad. Vardhaman is the only college in Hyderabad which don't allow mobile phones into the college, but still it has good infrastructure of the library, where you can uh, find a digital library for free. This college is booming from the past three years. I would strongly recommend choosing only computer science, IT, and uh, CSM branches here. Then comes Gokaraj Rangaraj at number three, which is a top consistent college in every aspect. This college has good student culture and it also has good faculty in it. Please select proper MSET course for web options. At number two, we have VNR Vignan Jyoti Institute of Engineering and Technological Science. This college is in a process of converting into university but at present it's an autonomous college and it also has good placements for every branch. At number 1 we have Chaitanya Bharati Institute of Technology which is topping the list from the past 10 years in the autonomous college sector. Yes, the fee here is highest when compared to other colleges but it's worth paying. They have some good connections with the MNCs which is resulting in good placements. If you have any doubts regarding anything related to education or counseling then do comment in the comment box. We reply to each and every comment within 24 hours. The comments which are done by our subscribers will get a quick response. If you still have any big queries, then you can connect with us on WhatsApp. As we are getting a lot of messages on WhatsApp, it is making it hard for us to reply to every message quickly. But we are trying our best to reply to every one within 24 hours. Share this video with your friends and do subscribe to our channel for getting a video updates from us. Thank you and all the best.